so uh, this is a um, deep dive about the infer cost of optimizations that we've been doing. Uh, our goals are to reduce infrastructure spend across all of uh, protocol labs, uh, clarify the cost per team by uh, deprecating shared accounts and, and establishing a regular cost reporting, um, ensure maximum efficiency through right sizing and removing unused infra, establishing cost baselines and providing best practices and tooling to keep costs low moving forward. Um, we established a uh, working group um, that meets weekly and they've been working very hard for months now to cut costs. Um, on the AWS side, uh, we've cut costs by 60%, Equinot, uh, on Equinix by 22%. Um, some of the highlights, uh, we, we've we been deprecating a really old account uh, called the Filecoin staging account. It's existed for over five five years and is, was kind of a catch-all for everything to do with Filecoin. Um, I'm not sure if, if, if anyone even knows what Go Filecoin is, but we found a couple nodes that were still running from there, right? So that's that's pretty old school. Um, so we, we established a uh, migration plan for any services that are production services that, that are running there. And then we uh, got rid of all the uh, known un unused infra. And then we enforced a tagging schema and performed a screen test that really got rid of all the orphaned and un unclaimed in infrastructure that had some really good good results. So thanks to all that that helped with that. Um, on, the, on the Equinix side, the, the focus was on the gateways. Uh, there was actually some bandwidth op optimizations that are good to share with, with the whole network. Uh, the migration to Kubo uh, and to the uh, resource manager had significant savings on our, our egress costs. And then we moved uh, some of the infra to, to, uh, to a uh, reservation. So um, the, the last bit I wanted to, to share was just the, the adoption of Cloud Custodian. It's a Python-based tool uh, that was really helpful for all of this. Um, it helps with, with uh, reporting, enforcing tags, and we're able to schedule our, our entire screen test with this tool. So for any team that's looking Looking to cut their cloud costs, uh, I would really suggest that tool. So the next steps, um, we now reached a, a baseline, I think, where the costs are clear for uh, each team. So, um, so some, some of the next steps now, now that we have that data is to establish long-term savings plans. Um, and we're looking to, to establish best practices to keep our costs down term basis, um, and finally, to provide best practices and tooling to keep uh, the cost low for other companies in uh, the, the uh, P PLN as well. I think it's really important that we uh, help the whole ecosystem cut costs and uh, do as, as much as possible to share this work that, that we're doing. So thanks to all, all of those that helped out, and also thanks to the uh, working core, the, the, the working group at core, because yeah, that, that's been a lot of effort, and we uh, hope to continue.